goal gone. It's a good one from Elise Perry. That's what the Phoenix are looking for, early wickets. Change now, Perry, and she's just gone full and straight, and that's just continued on. Actually, a really good delivery. Terrific use of the feet and lofting it over cover with that slightly open blade that she plays so freely with. So the Phoenix are going with the percentage. She's still... And again, all along the ground this time. Footwork was good, quick. And again, just opening the blade slightly. The innings in style with the ball. Elise Perry, she thinks there's an edge, as does the umpire. Well, it's just a little tickle down the leg side, but a big wicket this. Well, I mentioned how much freedom she likes to have through the offside, so Seamers will want to try and tuck her up, but I'm not entirely sure that that kind of a... And there you go, a, a measure of the confidence that uh, Annabelle Sutherland brings to the crease. Good she is at the moment, the form that she's in, and everyone always says when you're in good form, really make the most of it. Should be out. Mid on, yeah, safe catch. And just a bit of frustration for Davina Perrin. She knew she needed to try and throw a punch, try and get a shot away. But that bottom hand just came through. And Levick. Cut away nicely and timed and placed to perfection. Yeah, just a little bit of width. Pierce the gap beautifully. Fran Wilson out on the boundary. She's trying to stop. Hit powerfully down the ground. Beautiful shot. Sutherland finds the boundary yet again. Normally the shorter wide deliveries go through the offside a bit squarer, but this just get thumped down the ground. Powerful position. In for a first five. Down the wicket and played beautifully. And then Sutherland has started the momentum and has just continued in the partnership. Yeah, it's amazing how you work together in a batting partnership and you feed off each other. A brilliant shot. Annabelle Sutherland, the ball before, gives you the confidence that you... Hit away on the leg side. A vacant position on the field and a boundary to end a five halfway stage here. Pull the trigger. That's firmly struck. Oh no, that is not good. That is not high end cricket, I'm afraid. That should have just been a single and it's gifted Sutherland. It's from Sophie Devine, one of the most experienced international cricketers. And it has just gone straight through her. It's gone. Amy Jones does not drop those. She's been mighty impressive as Emily Arla. And that is a huge wicket in the context of the game. The dangerous Sutherland departs. Annabelle Sutherland, I think that's an under edge and it's a really good catch from Amy Jones. As we see so often, she is so clinical. Sutherland was just about to look dangerous. Firmly hit, but should be out. Yeah, well taken, Emily Arlock, deep square leg. It's one of her strengths, just gets caught in between. Either gets enough elevation or enough control. Quite dry, taking some spin. That's a powerful shot down the ground. Terrific from Alice Davidson-Richards. Sign and your ability to play spin. Now you... Calculate playing off the front foot. Good shot. Powerfully struck. Much needed boundary. Into a major contribution. 37 from 97. Really is getting to grips. 
standing right in front of her stumps. That is excellent batting. The tactics fairly clear from Emily Arlott to push it wide left. Yeah, brilliant. Brilliant stuff yet again. Just manipulating a position at the crease, being very calculated. She wants to hit the ball. Not only straight, but straight over. Lovely hit down the ground. A, a positive end to the Superchargers' innings. They finish with a four. Georgia Wareham hits that straight for four. And the Superchargers finish. And that is a, a very decent start from Sophie Devine. There was swing there for Cross. It was a little overpitched and a little wide. There was a way movement. Sophie Devine was ready for it. Just a bit over pitched and was able to drive it through the edge of the ball. Bold drag on. It was short, was there to be pulled, but a bottom edge sends it onto the stumps. Shot. Come back and pull the ball away, but it just stayed slightly low. Got the bottom edge onto the bottom of leg stump. Grace Ballinger thrilled. Make the early. Excellent strike. We showed a moment ago where Elise Perry is strong in this year's tournament. Yeah! Great catch. Build up of pressure, frustration for Elise Perry. And Lindsay Smith's fine tournament continues. Then the wicket comes. Elise Perry just trying to use her feet, hit the ball dead straight. It's not turning. Yeah! But all she can do is hit it straight. In the air, taken. Simple catch to Sutherland. And the Superchargers yet again reinforce their strong position. But not today, I think it's come quite low off the bat. An easy catch for Annabelle Sutherland. So the Northern Superchargers continuing, doesn't want to do. <laughs> oh, that's straight, real straight and given. Looked like it pitched in line. Impact looked adjacent. Okay, pitching in line. Impact's good. And the outcome is out. Going to go back on field to Chris. Chris, stay with your out decision. Yeah, good decision on field. Really close in real time. Phoenix need to rise. That'll help. That will help. That's a huge hit. What a strong shot down the, the ground from Sophie Devine. I need a few more of these. Sophie Devine. Mention is a good from the Birmingham end. That was a horrible fully, which has been just hit straight up in the air. Eyes on the umpire just to check it's not too high. I don't think it is from the Birmingham end. That was a horrible fully, which has been just hit straight up in the air. Eyes on the umpire just to check it's not too high. I don't think it is. Straight down the ground, straight into the hands of the fielder. Simple chance taken well by Kate Cross. Ballinger doing this round the wicket option of bowling slower balls into the pitch. A really good tactic on this surface, on the slower surface. Well, that didn't hit the surface, but it has been hit for four. Ball of the day was maybe thinking a bit of glory, maybe thinking stumps, and it cost a four. Responsibility. Yeah! Gone, another one goes. It was full. And the line was right for the shot, but once she missed. Same, Sarah Smith, for trying to take on this sort of option. The field was set for it. It was just the execution that was lacking, and the Australian Georgia Wareham. Oh, what a good catch! What a good catch from Kate Cross in the deep. Her footwork was really good. That's the key thing with these types of catches and them to be able to get your hands in the right position.
joins Karis Pavely in the middle. Make that nine. Nine down now. Lindsay Smith on target again. And again, it isn't the turn. It's just the angle of the arm quite square onto the <laughs> offside or the leg side, as the case was there with Hannah Baker. So Lindsay Smith finds herself on a hat trick. Ooh, it was on target, but. Oh, what a way to finish. An excellent performance in the field from the Northern Superchargers. That is the lowest score in the women's 100. Not a good performance from the Phoenix on their home patch.